Buffalo Behind the Scenes series is back. We're showing you what it takes to keep all of our Buffalo Olmsted parks beautiful year round. News 4's Katie Alexander takes us inside the greenhouses where crews have been busy all winter. The Olmsted Parks Conservancy puts about 10,000 new plants into the ground every year around Buffalo, and they all start right here in the greenhouses at Martin Luther King Jr. Park. It's just wonderful. I mean, we are a month ahead of everybody else, so spring has already appeared. Uh, most of the trees and shrubs that we winter over have, and perennials have started growing. And so have many of the annuals that were planted as seeds back in January. This time of year, everyone is busy sowing seeds, transplanting, and repotting to get all the plants ready to go into the ground in parks and traffic circles around the city in May and June. It's beautiful. It just adds a pop of color, adds, uh, just makes you uh, enjoy the parks more. Well, it's something that everyone should be proud of. Um, I consider us to be the curb appeal of Buffalo. But there is a ton of work to do to make that possible. And the Buffalo Olmsted Parks Conservancy counts on volunteers to help. We have over 850 acres of parkland and we have a very small staff. So when you realize that we have 2,000 volunteers that you know give us the ability to maintain these areas, it makes it a much easier lift on the conservancy. So community members, they can take pride in their park, they can help out, they can help plant things and really contribute to um, not only the health, but you know the green infrastructure that makes our city as great as it is. And this year, the city has a lot to celebrate, marking 150 years since Frederick Law Olmsted came to Buffalo to begin designing our award-winning park system. The Buffalo Olmsted Parks Conservancy has several events planned in the coming months in honor of the anniversary. We would love to see as many people as possible out in the parks this year. Um, I think years ago, people really were a little, a little bit more hands-on in the parks. Um, but as our maintenance efforts get a little bit more detailed, um, we can always use more volunteers. <laughs> if you'd like to learn more about any of the upcoming events or ways that you can get involved, go to the Founded on 4 section of our website, WIVB.com. In Buffalo, Katie Alexander, News 4. Katie, thank you.